To the pandemic now and the CDC expanding its surveillance of wastewater to help battle future outbreaks. There is progress across the country. New cases plunging in recent days, but COVID-related deaths up by more than 94% in the past month. This as the nation marks another painful milestone. 900,000 Americans lost to the virus. Here's ABC's Phil Lipoff. Tonight, across the country, the Omicron surge is waning, with cases and hospitalizations both down dramatically. And as free rapid home tests become more available, the CDC is now focusing on wastewater to help track and get ahead of the next outbreak. Wastewater surveillance can serve as an early warning system for the emergence of COVID-19 in a community. More than 400 sites are currently collecting waste samples in the U.S., with 200 more coming online in the next few weeks. Boston, one of many cities using this type of surveillance to fight COVID. When you get the wastewater samples, it's before people have started to develop symptoms. So it's the earliest sign that there's going to be a surge. Nationwide, daily new infections plunging nearly 60% since the peak. The number of Americans battling COVID in the hospital down 40%. But COVID deaths, a lagging indicator, are still rising. Nearly 2,400 Americans are now dying every day, and that's up by almost 95%. And the nation crossing that grim milestone, more than 900,000 COVID deaths. The majority of those dying, still the unvaccinated. Akiko Garcia's 57-year-old unvaccinated father, Josh, died this week from COVID in California. For some people, it might just be like a cough. For some people, like my dad, it might be in your life. So um, take it seriously. And here in New York City, Governor Kathy Hochul has announced for the first time since November that all important metric of single day positive cases has fallen below 4% and hospitalizations with for the first time are at their lowest level since Christmas. Some key developments, Phil. Thank you. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.